Hi, today I am going to make geranium. A lovely summertime flower. Material that you need are crepe paper in any floral color and green, a thick wire for the stem, thin wire, a color pen matching with the crepe paper, slightly darker tone, a green floral tape and a bit of tissue paper. The stencils and measurements are all given at the end of the video. Take the piece for the, the petal for the flower, fold it in half and then cut out a petal shape on it. So just like, go like this and go straight down and then you cut a stem. So when you open it, this is the shape that you get. Now just stretch it. So you get a shape like this. So you make five others like this. I have already made them. Now take a petal and apply glue on the stem. And then stick the other one on it at a at an angle. Like this. And again apply glue. And stick the third one. So stick all five like this, making a fan shape. And this is how it will look. Now just put this aside and cut out a small piece from the paper, from the same paper, about half an inch long, like this. Stretch it, apply glue on it. Take a piece of wire, thin wire, about 6 centimeters long and wind this piece on it. Like this. Now cut out a piece from the green tape first take it out and then cut the tape in half we just need a very small piece like this and wind this on the tape on the wire leaving about half a centimeter from the or one centimeter from the top and just wind this This is how it will look. Now take the petal and on the reverse side apply glue on one side and stick the other side over. Just hold it for a couple of seconds so that it dries. Then take the stem that we prepared, apply glue on it, just a dash. Open out the petals and insert this through the petal. So just open out the petals also so that you know what you are doing. Just pull it through. 
let's take it. The green part of the stem should show a bit. Now take the orange pen. and put draw a couple of lines on each petal very light strokes like this and this is how the flower would look and take the piece for the sepal and stretch it Now give four folds on it, tiny ones. Then cut out a V shape on one side. So you, when you open it out, you get this. Now just apply glue. and wind this on the base of the flower you may have to give a few creases so that the sepal fits properly just twist the end like this this is your flower Now take the green tape again, you can cut it in half so this piece is already This gives a neater look rather than using the whole tape, width of the tape, use this, this is better. Now just wind this from the base of the sepal till the end of the wire. This is the flower. So I have made four more like this in the same way. For the bud, take the thin wire and cut about uh, five inch, five centimeter long thin wire, and take the piece for the sepal, stretch it, apply glue all over and stick this on top of the thin wire first fold it over like this and then just crunch it up and roll it roll it between your finger and thumb So you get a shape like this. Then in the take the petal piece, sorry the sepal piece, and again as we did for the flower, just stretch it, give folds on it, four folds, cut a V shape on one end, and you open it out, you get five sepals apply glue and stick this on the bud covering about half of the bud This is what you get. Now again, take the tape, cut out half again and wind it on the 
base of the bud till the end of the wire. And this is how the buds will look. I have made five buds in the same way. Cut out a piece from the thin wire about six to seven centimeter long and take a thin strip of the green tape, stretch it and wind this on the wire. what you get. Now take a leaf and score lines on it using scissors or anything. Make them like a you know veins like this. Now apply glue in the center of the leaf. Like this and then just stick the wire that we made on it. So this is how the leaf would look. Do this with all the leaf, the big size, the medium. You can make different sizes if you want because a geranium plant normally has a lot of leaves. So this is how it will look. Take the tissue paper and the thick wire, first fold the tissue paper in half, in half again. You don't want too long a piece of the tissue paper. Just apply glue on it well. My glue is not coming out properly but anyway. Take the thick wire and leave about 2 to 3 inches from one side and then just wind the tissue paper. And cover again about 3 to 4 inches of the wire, tear off the extra if there is. Just wind the paper like this. Now take all the flowers and the buds. So first hold all the flowers together. And then the buds around the flowers at a slightly lower height. So make a bunch like this and take the floral tape cut out a long piece like this and stretch it and wind this on the base of the floor wind them in such a manner that you have about Three centimeter long stem of the flower. Then just take the thick wire, hold it on the stem, and wind it over.
Now made another bunch in the same way. So I'm just going to put it at a slightly lower height and wind it over, wind the tape over on it also. So this is what it look like. Now you can start attaching leaves. So take one leaf. And wind the tape over and since there are a lot of leaves and the stem is very short so you have to keep them very close to each other just like just just keep so I'm putting the small one first then the medium ones and then the big ones this is how it look now position the flower in buds so just open out the buds first they are always usually below the flower, so just like position them out like this. Then position the leaves, just open them out. These are almost horizontal, so start with the bigger leaves. smaller ones this is how it will look after you finish the whole thing now just give a curve to the flower stem also open out the flowers position them and give a bend to the main stem also the one covered with tissue paper I'm going to bend this since I'm going to insert this in my planter and this is how your geranium would look the stencils that you need to cut are a small piece 1 cm by 1 cm for a bud, another piece of the floral paper that is 2.5 cm long and 1 cm wide, cut 5 pieces per flower, then a small green piece 1 cm by 1 cm, cut 1 piece per bud and 1 piece per flower. Then I have made 3 leaves, 3 leaf sizes, you can make different ones if you want. The smallest is 3 cm by 3.5 cm, another is 4.5 cm by 5.5, then the biggest I have made is 6 cm by 6.5 cm. These are all different sizes and you can cut as many as you want.